Bridgerton? Yeah. Mm. Heard of it? Mm. I'm just going to give you a minute to consider that once more. I did try to steal a... Oh, from Br sorry, from Bridgerton. Got you. I didn't listen to what you were saying. Now I have. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, can you please say it again? Yeah. <laughs> I'm India Armatifio. And I'm Corey Milchrist. And we are from uh, Queen Charlotte Bridgerton Story, and Pop Buzz have asked us to interview each other. Mm -hmm. Here we go. I think I'm starting. What were your first impressions of me, Corey? What were my first impressions of you? Yep. They were clouded oh. by my first impressions of the other man who could have played Here we go. George, Here who we was. Go. Uh, Prince Charming embodied. He was about 6'4". Uh, he was. Chiseled jaw, he was. pearly blue eyes. The most handsome man I've ever seen. Uh, and he came out the room with India, having just read as George and I thought, this is my, this is my day over. Yeah. They've already, they've already done it, they've already cast him. Yeah. And then I tried to get to know you. You uh, did. Quickly. Yeah. Yeah. How did that go? Failed. Really terribly. Yeah. Yeah. Wasn't good. Embarrassed myself. What were your, do I, should I ask you as well? Yeah, yeah what please. were your, what were you, what? What, India. What, what? Thank you yeah, for sitting down with me. It's all right. Uh, we've all been wondering. Have we? Um, what were your first impressions of, uh, of Corey you. M? Yeah. Um, my first impressions of Corey M were uh, pleasant. Thought you were. You seemed prepared. It seemed. Yes. And then we went and did the chemistry read, and I realised it was all a lie. Yeah. You were wearing a trench coat. I was wearing a, a trench dark coat. trench coat and yes. an earring. I was, yeah, and, and a shaved head. And you had no hair. Yeah. And I'd been told that there was a guy that they really wanted. He's just shaved all his hair off and he walked in and I thought, here he is. Mm -hmm. That's um, the guy. That's the guy. Do you want to ask me another question, maybe? Please, thank you so much. That's right. Um, <laughs> the iconic Bridgerton violin covers. Okay, sorry, okay. <laughs> okay, <laughs> the good. iconic Bridgerton violin covers are back. What song oh. would you want covered as your own? personal entrance music? It's a very good Such question. Such a good question. Mm. Written by me, of course. And not by Pop Buzz at all. No. <laughs> um, what would I like as a as an intro? I would like Jack Harlow's and Little Mars X's Industry Baby. Mm -hmm. It's such a good workout song, and okay. I think a violin cover would be phenomenal. What about phenomenal. you? Phenomenal. Yeah. Uh, my milkshakes bring all the boys to Your the milk earth. Your milkshake? <laughs> yeah. Really? I remember at really? school we had to do a dance competition. We all had to dress up as different uh, characters. Yes. And mine was, my, my last name is Milkreast. Yes, People used to call me Milkman. Yeah. Uh, so mine was Corey the Milkman Milkreast. Yeah. Uh, and my milkshakes bring all the boys to, to the, the yard. yard. Fantastic. Yeah. Corey, after reading the script, yes. what scenes were you most nervous to film? Uh, Apart from the whole thing. The basically. entire thing, yeah. 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 The scene on the first day, I, I, I take Charlotte to uh, Buckingham House. Like 50 extras, 16 horses, a carriage, an entire palace, Blenheim Palace. Even talking about it now, wow, I can nervous. feel nervous. Don't get nervous. Ain't, Ain't nobody, nobody shaking. shaking. <laughs> um, uh, we, uh, yeah, that was that was a lot. Um, most nervous to film, probably uh, a scene in episode four, three, four. Uh, four, no, the end of three, sorry, where- Oh yes, my Lord, there's a, yeah. There's a big scene, um, a big scene that, that you were in, well. and you were nervous, but yeah. I was also nervous, because I knew it was a big scene for you, and I wanted to get my lines right. It turned out okay in the end, but um, yeah, I remember going into You're the day, amazing. like, oh, I'm that, amazing I in that no, 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 scene. No, no, no. It's literally I, his no, no, no. scene. No, no, How no, no, am I amazing? No. But it, cu it cuts to you, and it, uh, yeah, it, it's all in the editing, face, all in the editing. I think you did a cracking job. Cracking. And Speaking you, of cracking, yeah. sorry, go on, no, I no, interrupted it's you. It's right, it's right, it's fine. Let's go, crack go. into the next one. Go on. Uh, if you had to arrange a marriage for each other with any character from the Bridgerton universe, who would you pair them with? Oh my gosh. Who would you pair me with? I guess that's my, what In I'm asking. In the Bridgerton yeah. universe. Um, Eloise. Were you going to say yeah. the same thing? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Eloise. Yeah. Yeah. Humour, just like... Normal. Very normal, very yeah. like straight talking. No nonsense. Yeah. What you see is what you get. Very beautiful. Bingo. Um, uh, Featherington. Uh, <laughs> Lady Featherington. She okay. could. She could. You could. You could relax and you could enjoy all the spoils of her scheming. Lady Featherington. <laughs> yeah. I'm just going to give you a minute to consider that once more. I'll take it. Do you know what? Uh, Luke Thompson plays Benedict. Yes. 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 Let's go Benedict. Yeah. Yeah. Really sweet. I think you guys. Artistic. Would... Yes. Exactly. So he could bring uh, that to where you lack and yeah. stuff. So um, you know, you'd be brilliant together. Thanks. The, the conversation would fly. 
Thank you. <laughs> Thanks. Did you get any advice from the main Bridgerton cast before filming? Um, no, I did not. Did you? I did. I did actually. Um, from Golda, who just said, "Have fun, and enjoy your sh your ride. The ride. Enjoy your ride. Enjoy. Yeah. Enjoy your ride. <laughs> yep. So, who in the Queen Charlotte cast yeah. would you trust most to be your royal advisor? Probably my royal advisor in the show, who is Sam Clement. Yes. Because he is just great and very mature, mm -hmm. and uh, seems to know a lot about life. What about you? I would go probably, well, I mean, Sam is a, yeah, Sam yeah. would be a valuable ally. Maybe you, <gasps> uh, maybe my uh, advisor in the show, support Freddie, network, Freddie, Freddie Dennis. Reynolds Dennis. Freddie Dennis, Dennis yeah. who, uh, who I now live with, having not Literally. met him before. Yeah, who are we kidding, it's Freddie. Okay. Uh, next one's yours. Is it? Take it away. Um, which of your castmates smells the nicest? Do you know who smells the nicest, I think? Yeah, I think I might know her. <laughs> is Tom. Yes. Tom always yes. smells really nice. Tom is the director, Tom, uh, Tom Berrican. Yeah. Uh, solid bloke. Always smells like very masculine in a nice way, like, uh, okay. like apple wood. Okay. Um, but you smell great. That, oh, and that's thanks. what you want to I wasn't hear. waiting for that at and all. And that's not forced out of my mouth at all. No. Uh, who do you think smells the nicest? I think you smell quite nice. Oh, come on. Not right now, most of the time. Thanks. And, um, I just had a mint, actually, too. Couldn't smell it. And I will, will go with Tom, because it's very, yeah. yeah. You know when Tom's walked in the room. In a good way. Yes. Bridgerton, yeah. right? Mm. Heard of it? Heard of, mm. uh, is known for its extravagant sets. Yeah. Did you steal any props as a memento once you finished filming? I took... I know you tried to. I did try to steal a palace. Didn't work out, unfortunately. But I did actually end up taking like a placard that was on a box that I got to sit in um, with my name. Well, not my name. Young Queen Charlotte engraved. What about you? Uh, you saying that you wanted to steal a palace reminds me when I... I this is really random, but when I was five, my dad told me that we were moving house. Uh, and I... Hang on. Hang, Sorry, hang I just... On. Uh, <laughs> and I always thought that like, I was like, when are the men getting here? because I thought they would have to pick up the house and move that the house. That was really cute. Uh, so you saying, I wanted to steal a yeah. palace made me think of just people just picking up a palace. Awesome. Um, I stole a ring. I tried to steal a ring and then I got permission. So it kind of ruined Backfired. the thrill of it, but it was... Mm. Can I ask you something? Sorry, yes. No, it's fine. Um, but if Lady Whistledown were to write about you, mm. what completely random and trivial scandal would you be involved in? Lego comes to my mind, but what? I have no idea why. <laughs> So let's move past that. Yes, um, quickly. What trivial scandal? Probably like upsetting someone because of being competitive. Um, yes, I can account for that. Yeah. I uh, would think probably um, uh, not enjoying the food and just not having a terrible time. Yeah, complaining about the food. Yeah. Yeah. Very picky. And finally, gentle reader. Yes. Not a question. Go on. Compliment each other. No, thank you. <laughs> yeah, you're right. I am very kind. I'm very kind and very sweet, aren't I? Yeah. Um, no, you are, you're, you. you're quite funny. Quite, uh, yeah, thank you, you. Well, you can laugh with you, you can also laugh at you. Thank you. You are um, a right all-round guy. A it's solid it's guy. Solid bloke. Solid bloke. He's um, decent, he's decent. There you go. Yeah. Well, uh, thank you for sitting down with me, India. And for sitting um, down with me and answering these questions. Uh, well, I, I wouldn't have done anything else with, oh, my, with my Thursday. Thank you. Yeah, and Pop. thank you to you. And thank you, Pop Buzz. Thank you, well. Pop Buzz. Thank for watching. Of course, if you like this video, you should definitely subscribe to Pop Buzz. <laughs> Thanks, Amazing. guys. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you. That was really fun. Yeah.